he's Sagittarius. So, this is going to be your reading for, you know, the rest of November. And, um, hope that all is well. Um, just shuffle up your cards and let you know what's going on with your energies. <laughs> been probably waiting some time to take a leap of faith with somebody and also to communicate because when you end when something ends there's a new beginning with everything you're wondering if you could actually move toward this person and it may be a lot to just kind of handle to get to them. I'm feeling like they do have um, something to tell you in regards to love, you know. Saying something nice and sweet to you. You know, I don't, I don't think this was totally over. I think there's a new beginning here that you have with somebody and it took time after things blew up. So I feel like. Maybe you want to give clarity to somebody. And maybe you guys are actually going to be talking it out. I kind of do see that. Give me some more for my Sagittarius. My people. I feel like allowing this energy to come in, you'll actually... I mean, of course, when we're allowing, great things can just manifest from that, you know, such as the fortune, truth, and then also the two of cups. This is really good energy. And I feel like after things start over, it's going to pick up quick. But I really just don't see anything bad, you know, I see a reconciliation, I see, I feel like this is just letting your walls down and just letting it come in, because there's love here, there's a lot of love in between the both of you, you guys are definitely going to be together, king of the crystal cups and the queen of crystal cups, crying in each other's arms, making things right. That I, I really can't pull any more cards except the animal cards. You're going to end up with this person, you know? And I feel like you've possibly ended things with this person before. Some of you could, you know, could have been in a long-term rela relationship with this person. But I see it all coming back together. You took the time for yourself. Gaining clarity from everything that happened. A strong love connection right here. Queen and King of Crystal Cups. In the same reading. Like, this is just amazing right here. Let me show you guys. I can fan these out the best that I can without dropping them. These are big cards. See that? The queen, the king, and the two of cups. Look, they're facing each other. So let's see what this... Um, 
what the animals have to say, the spirit animals. The message for Sagittarius in regards to this reading for them. Okay. You got the panda. Enjoy the sanctuary of solitude to regain self-esteem and tranquility. And this is you just basically staying to yourself and making sure that you're taking good care of yourself. But, but most importantly, staying out of the ego, staying in the present. You see the thoughts. Practice mindfulness, awareness. That's basically what it's telling you. As you, you know, with love situations, with anything, really, you just let everything be. Allow anything that comes toward you. Um, just be present because you're not the mind. And when you're present, then everything flows to you. And I feel like this is how it's going to happen. Okay? Well, Sagittarius, I hope. Hope that you have a great rest of November, you know? Bye, guys.